Alright boys, today we're going to be starting with a base that I call the uh, Mini Terminator. It's a 1x2 solo duo design. I'm going to show you guys how to build it. It has stability bunker. I'll put rate cost in the description.
So keep in mind, it's not gonna have a shooting floor or anything. It's not really. It's, it's just a bunker base, a solo duo bunker base. Personally, for me, I would use this as a storage base for if I'm gonna move to a bigger base, but I need somewhere to keep my loot, which is what I'm doing right now on my server. I will have a V2 version of this out pretty soon. Just a little bit better. You know, a little, a little bit more improvements. Things I could, uh, I could have done better. explain everything about the uh, what's supposed to be done how the base works as soon as I finish building This right here is just so that, uh, it's just a little bit harder to blast the loot rooms. And if, uh, somebody comes in through here, they have to blow through this, because they, they won't be able to go through this. Uh, I'll show you guys how the bunker works. You can see the nice loot rooms. Furnaces would go here, your three furnaces, airlock, we you put in some more doorways. Preferably, I would do window loot rooms, because the windows, you can seal up with a high call window, about 7-8 rockets destroyed. If you have good use of sheet armor. Now, I don't have, I have these frames of stone, because no door in this game can surpass four rockets just like these. Of course, it'd be a little bit worse for off for an online raid because you won't be able to replace the doors back as easily. So these are kind of optional, but I'm trying to keep the up keep a little bit low. So it's under a thousand for everything. One thing I also realized I forgot was the thing was the shelf. I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. Can I do it? I'm just gonna put a reminder in the in the video to add the shelf. Alright, so for the sake of the video, let's just pretend this is high wall. Alright, I'm gonna show you guys how the bunker is working. So how you would do the bunker, for one, is you go like that, it's a stability bunker, you place the half wall, the half wooden wall. You don't you don't have to upgrade it to thatch or anything, you can keep it like that. And then you place this and you would upgrade this to high wall. And people people could be confused. Although regardless, it's still gonna be a lot of rockets to go through this base. Especially for a one by two expanded design. Although the base is pretty upgraded, so I don't I think it would look like a raid target. Better than a two by two. I'd rather use this over a two by two. But yeah, as far as that is it. I'll make a stronger base that's also low upkeep. Yeah, but this one thing I gotta say is that you see how this is a lot less than a a two by two. But has about the same the just as many loot rooms almost. 
and for fitting the tier one slash tier three, you would place it along this wall, this wall right here. Which means, for that time, you would soft side out this and use a double door frame so you can fit it. Thanks for watching. Uh, tell me if you like the base. I'll have a new version out tomorrow.